and the it's within you. It's within you. It's within you. He said to me three times, it's within you. We went out. We went out of the room. We went out. There were two rooms. But in the middle, there was a wall and there was a television above his head. His son was standing next to him. And again, he said to me three times, but you must prophesy. But you must prophesy. And he said it again, but you must prophesy. And I woke up and I started doing these things in meetings. And all of a sudden, it's like, I realized it's not the gift. I realize I speak from the word. And I realize, I mean, I have dreams where since that day I had dreams where I dream what people's houses look on the inside. Then I tell somebody the story, then we walk in there, then the house is like that. I dream what people pray and speak to God and then I phone them and they burst out in tears because I told them what they pray. You ask the question, God, I want more. There has to be more. What is it? What is the more? God said, this is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. What is the more? Why, what is the more? What, what, what is the more? Uh, this is the secret. It's everything. God says, you don't need to be afraid of the dreams. You've asked for accuracy. But it's not why it's, he's giving it to you. I'm talking about accuracy, very accurate, divine accuracy, like the stuff I shared while I preach. He said, it's because you cried out for revival. You specifically said, I want to know Jesus more. I want to see Jesus. Thank you. 